Welcome back to my channel. Let's start with daily dose of tech news. Since 2020, Apple has been working to eliminate Intel chips by transitioning the entire Mac lineup to Apple Silicon chips, and 2022 is expected to be the year when the transition is completed. One of the major Mac lines still using Intel chips is the Mac Pro, but a refreshed model is in the works for 2022. Amid reports of Apple working on a notebook with a foldable display, how exactly could such a device be implemented? Amazon today expanded its sale on the 24-inch M1 iMac, 8-core GPU, 256GB, to include more colors, available for $1,349.99, down from $1,499. This sale price won't be seen until you add the iMac to your cart and receive an automatic coupon. Apple would rather pay a maximum of 50 million euros in fines than address concerns brought forward by the Dutch Competition Authority regarding developer access to third-party payment methods on the App Store. Following a few deals on the cellular models of the iPad Mini 6 earlier this year, Amazon now has the entry-level 64GB Wi-Fi iPad Mini 6 for $459, down from $499. This sale is only available in space gray, and it's in stock and ready to ship from Amazon today. Apple has praised Dutch police as well as customers and staff at an Amsterdam store where a hostage situation yesterday came to a close with no injuries to the public and the suspect detained in custody. Apple has added Dutch language voice recognition support for Siri in the latest HomePod 15.4 beta, further preparing the HomePod Mini for release in the Netherlands in the near future. Apple is in preliminary talks with new suppliers about back-end orders for its first in-house 5G modem chips for iPhones. 